if you can get our weekly food shop without any help. Don't you dare. You're supposed to be feeding the family. Get me out of here, please. Jojo, come back. What's happening, Free Game? We are coming to you live. But not live. From our home here in London. We've got another fantastic, fun video for you guys today. Let us know where you are coming live, but not live from in the comments below. We love hearing from you, Free Game. Let's connect. Today, guys, we are doing another fun food shopping challenge. But this time, it is involving... Me. Yes, today we have set Jojo the challenge of doing our family weekly food shop all by himself. That is without any influence from us adults. It's all by himself, all his choices and not our choices. It's about time too. Yes, Jojo's right, it is about time as we have done many weekly food shops and you've just been a bystander really, haven't you? Pretty much, yeah. You've helped out a lot, but the question is, has he learned anything from these challenges? So today we'll put it to the test. So hold on, do I have like a budget? No, we just want to see if you can get our weekly food shop everything we need without any help so it's completely down to you okay so but like just for the week okay i got i think i got this but before we go out we've got something really special to show you that has really been helping out jojo right guys jojo is at that age where he's going through a lot of special changes that we all go through and that involves certain things like getting pimples and having to have some sort of skincare routine which is why we're really happy to share with you this amazing brand called 31st state. Yeah, they're all about natural products that don't contain any SLS or SLES, parabens, no aluminium, no GM ingredients. So they're all natural, good for body and good for the skin. They're all vegan and cruelty free, which is really important to us. They confirm this in fact on their packaging by saying only tested on teenage boys, not on animals. That's good. That means it must be pretty accurate stuff. Yeah. As you can see, Jojo has the two-in-one body wash, roll-on deodorant, overnight cleaning pads, which are biodegradable as well, which is amazing, foaming face wash, and spot control gel. And all of these products are powered by lots of amazing natural minerals as well, such as tea tree, zinc, copper, magnesium, and many, many more. And you've really enjoyed using them as well, haven't yeah, you? Yeah, it's been really helpful. And also, I felt it felt um, very relaxing just doing it every time, just like getting like, either on my face or under my armpits. Yeah, you've had a nice routine going, haven't you? Yeah. We thoroughly recommend you guys checking out their site, so follow the link in the description. And if you use our special code, FAMILYFREEDOM15, you can get 15% off your purchase. So head to the link in the description and check out this amazing brand. So we're outside the supermarket. Jojo, why don't you tell the free game where you have chosen to come for this challenge? I've chosen to go to Sainsbury's. Why Sainsbury's? I feel like there's a good amount of variety there. Okay, well you're going to need that for this challenge. You ready to go in? Yes. Let's do this. So you're going for the trolley? Could just do a basket, would that be enough? No, I think a trolley. Come on then. Where first, Jojo? Lego. Don't you dare. I mentioned very clearly. Look at this stuff. No, no. That's so cool. That is cool, actually. Three and one? Yeah. So it's three different rides? Or three different rides, yeah. Wait, no, no, listen, this, this is a food challenge. There's nothing about <gasps> non-food items. Look, 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 the chase. Oh. Stop distracting me. I Come love on. Star Wars, though. Food is that way. I have to keep my hand on you, make sure you go to the food area. Cucumbers, I'm liking the look at this already. I'll take this one. It's quite, it's quite chunky. The good thing is, it's just me and you today, Jojo. Mummy's not about, so she can't influence you, okay? Yeah, um, although you might do a bit of influencing yourself. I would never do that. I don't know what you're talking about. What have you got your eye on? Organic spinach. Okay. I'll get another bag of this uh, mocking salad as well. This is looking healthy so far, Jojo. I've got to admit, I'm quite happy. Wait till we get to the frozen section. Quite happy this lasted that long. Remember as well, it's no budget, but you do have to get enough food for us for a week. Yes. You can't just go crazy on snacks. <laughs> what are you thinking? I'm thinking a good bag of red onions. Oh, you could get in the organic stuff as well. Nice choices. Thanks. Yeah, good choices so far. Ooh. What have you spotted? Also, red cabbage is actually really good for you, so I was thinking we could maybe get uh, red cabbage too. It seems like you have been learning stuff. <laughs> so you're going for one of those? How many? I was thinking um, just the one. This one okay. Fine. I've got to admit, this trolley's looking pretty good at the moment. 
Yeah, it's looking pretty healthy to start off with. So far, it's a good thing we carry through the fresh section, eh? Yeah. Okay, I was thinking we could also get um, some spring onions. Spring onions? So red onions and spring onions? Yeah. I like my onions. Goes to show when you have no budget, you can pick multiple varieties of onions. Potatoes. Yeah, I was thinking of a good bag of potatoes. Reckon. I don't even have to influence you. <laughs> this is a great choice. I'll get a fat bag of the organic ones. Organic as well, hey? Yeah. Jojo, I'm really liking your choice of organic again yeah, and again. I really like good organic stuff. Fruitile, this is where you excel, Jojo. They have some candy floss grapes or cotton candy grapes if you're in America. Is it, is it like that? I think so, that yeah. yeah. I'm so glad you looked at that because when you said grapes, I was so tempted to influence you, but I don't have to. Yeah. Of course, easy peelers. Yeah. It wouldn't be a shopping trip without you getting them, would it? You see, I've got one of everything, but I'm gonna get, not one, not two, not three, but four bags. Really? Yes. Well, I guess there's no budget, so you don't have to think about that, do you? Yeah. This is just gonna be one afternoon snack for you, isn't it? Pretty much, yeah. <laughs> so that's four, is it, you're gonna get? Yeah, four bags. I don't know why I'm getting excited about him getting the nectar price stuff. I have no control over this budget, so <laughs> what will be, will be. I'm thinking a nice pack of blueberries. I love my uh, fresh fruit in the morning when I have my porridge, so these will be quite handy. So that's just going to be one breakfast worth. Remember, you've got to think about the whole week. I'm probably going to get some bread later on, so that can cover another breakfast, which is toast. This isn't just your breakfast, though. It's me and mummy, too, yeah? Yeah, I know, I know. That's a nice trolley as we leave the fresh section. Yeah. And go on to the rest of the store. Okay, you found a more extensive vegan range now. Not trying to influence, but I'm hoping the ratio of this will be lower than what we've got already. Maybe. <laughs> really? <laughs> Thanks for your reassurance. Get some uh, tofu. Sriracha tofu? Yes. And that one is 285. Oh, I'm still gonna get it. Of course you are, you've got no budget, have you? <laughs> so yeah, I've tried these before and they're really nice, they're like really nice. So I'm gonna get some of these. They're going in, are they? Yeah. Okay, so I was thinking we could get some hummus. No arguments from me for hummus. He's gone for the organic one as well. Yeah, I like, I like my organic stuff, okay? Iron up cheeses and that now, are we? Yeah. I'm not liking this powerlessness of following you around and not being able to control no, what you I, buy. I'm not getting, yeah, I'm just, I'm just thinking about it. So are you open to influence, is that what you're saying? You can, like, give me ideas for stuff. I mean, I'll probably get it if it's something I like. Ten pizzas. I mean, no, you can like, remind me of, like, a product or something. But Twenty pizzas. I think I'm just going to get a bunch of pizzas. Yes! Okay, I was thinking of getting all of these juices because I've tried them before, they're really nice. So I was thinking, I know it's not food, but it's true. It comes underneath it. I swear this is just your own little snack, isn't it? Yeah, just for now, you know. I'm kind of just like... You're supposed to be feeding the family. You can have some of it too. Good. <laughs> Uh-oh. Jojo, have you seen the price? Mummy will go crazy. Yeah, she's not here though. So... so we'll... Pot noodles are going in, this is really happening. Simple as that, three people, three pot, nope, okay, more. Oh no, we're gonna be here all day. Six. At least we've got greens to go with it. Yeah, at least we have. What you got your eye on next? Some bread. There's a whole aisle of bready stuff here, but are you looking at this in particular? I'm looking at like fresh loaves, yeah. I was thinking we could get this very like seedy sourdough one. Gets good. my vote. <laughs> Although it could just be your breakfast by the sounds of it. <laughs> what about ours? We'll have one. some toast together, yeah? No, I could get another though, but I'll think about it. Oh, I like the looks of this one. Tomato and red onion for catcher. Did I just influence? Oh no. Yeah, you did, but don't tell anybody about it, okay? Okay, no. Moving on, Look, moving on. I found the buttons. <laughs> oh my goodness. Get me out of here, please. He's making it hard just to do your regular <laughs> shopping. Okay, what beans do you want then? I'm going to get these organic beans and um, these other organic beans. How many of these are you getting? Four. Just to confirm, four what? Beans. So this is part of me that can't stand it but likes it at the same time. <laughs> I just thought, crumpets. Look, these ones are reduced to 74p each, right? So, and then this is a nine pack. So if I get two of those, that will add up to £1.48. That's £1.35. I think I'll get more value of two of these, except for just like one of those, if you know what I mean. So, so you are in some way thinking about price. Of course, yeah. I like this. You are learning stuff. 
We're just admiring how it's October and mince pies are out already. It's not even Halloween yet. Well, I'm yeah. thinking of Christmas. Spooky. That's how early we are. Spooky. I think we're getting some Alpro milk. Question is what Alpro milk? Yeah, that is the question. Oh, they've got what? plenish. I like that one as well. Not that I'm influencing at all. I wouldn't ever do that. Yeah, I'm, I was thinking some of the uh, barista oat milk. Really? I was thinking. Do you have coffee, do you? <laughs> oh, is it for coffee? That's what baristas is, yeah. Oh, is it? Oh, no, I'll get like a different one then. Um, I'll get this one. Um, okay, this one. So two oat milks. Two oat milks. Jojo just mumbled to me. I'm probably gonna leave this aisle. Oh, there's chocolate though. I know, like chocolate isn't exactly an essential, but like. Well, maybe there's a way that I could be persuaded to be okay with it. Maybe get me a bar. Yeah, I'll get you a bar. I've got advent calendars, guys. It is October and we have advent calendars. Always Come on. Now. Although I wouldn't mind that advent calendar. Yeah. <laughs> Come on, Jojo, Christmas present for me. Anyway, back to the chocolate. What were you thinking of? I was thinking. This essential weekly shopping budget item. <laughs> this is for you. Really? Yes. Well, I mean, you're paying for it, so. <laughs> Treated myself. And I'm getting this one for me. And also, I was thinking of getting some chocolate for Mummy as well. Oh, really? She's influencing you and she doesn't even know it. I think I'll go down like the actual dedicated confectionery aisle, though, for some of that. What are we thinking about meals, Jojo? There's some things which are just snacky or items. Are you actually thinking about meals coming together with this? Yes. So I was quite inspired from some of the meals that we had in some of the fine dining restaurants in Barbados. We had some good meals. And so I was thinking about recreating stuff like that at home. So we need some very specific ingredients. Okay. I mean, we did have some great meals there. If we you want to know what he's referring to, check out when we did an all-inclusive, all-you-can-eat video in Barbados. You'll see some of the amazing meals that we had there. So, I'm going to get some balsamic vinegar glaze. I know it's very specific, but yeah. Oh, yes, because they would drizzle this all over the food, wouldn't they? Yep. It would be mostly for a little bit of flavour, but display, wasn't it? Yeah. Ah, I see what you're going for there. Good choice. As you can see, the trolley is looking pretty full at the moment, and I have no idea where we are with the amount spent on this. There's no tracking, there's no budget, I have no idea. I'm just gonna have to find out at the end. So watch to the end of the video where we'll share with you exactly how much he spent. What's next in this no budget haul? Stuffing. I love stuffing. Choices, choices, choices. I've got a few different flavors of this one. Yeah. Wild sage and onion, pink lady apple, honey and herb. Wild sage and onion. What one you got there? Cranberry orange roasted chestnut stuffing. Mm -hmm. Sounds amazing. I love that you're going for the Christmassy ones. You might as well get me the advent calendar now. <laughs> and some mince pies. Look, stuffing isn't just like specific to Christmas, okay? Okay, just to make you aware, one pack, that's quite a small pack, probably won't do the three of us if you're yeah. thinking about meals. Not as good. It's not me influencing, it's me being realistic. You get two. But you're, you're getting me involved too much now. I just gave you a pointer. Fine, we'll get two. I don't want to go nuts down this aisle, okay? You can't get any granola then. Granola has nuts in. <sighs> Jojo? Jojo, come back. Right, I'll go and put all this back then. See you later, mate. <laughs> so seriously, are you thinking of getting something down here? You do have milk, and that's just basically for our tea, isn't it? Well, I mean, one could be for your tea, one could be for cereal. Okay. I'm gonna get some of this granola. Cause... We've had that one before, right? Yeah, we've had this one before. That's why you got that in the last challenge that you did. Did I? When you had to fill the basket. I think I did get this one, yeah. Well, now you don't need to carry this. It's just about getting it in there. I was hoping we wouldn't go down here and he'd miss this, but nope, he's found it. Have you like making bars too? Oh yeah, this is for me as well, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, you can share these with me. I just keep thinking you're getting this all for yourself. I don't know no, why. No, no, it's for the weekly shop. At least he gets the challenge, I can't argue with that. I think this might be what you were referring to as confectionery, yeah. which is chocolate and stuff. Yeah. And you've not wasted any time getting some chocolate. Yep, I'm getting these ones for mummy. Whoa, 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 I'm here taking you and I get one bar and she gets two. No, 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 you can share these with her. Maybe I should have said they're for you and mummy. But... Okay. <laughs> I, sh I shouldn't be bothered free gang, but you know when that happens right in front of you and you can't control it. Wait, hold on. What's going on? I know that she likes this one quite a lot, so no, I'm going to keep that one. I'm going to put this one back. So I'm also going to get some Ritter Sport Marzipan chocolate too. Big decisions, Jojo. We're in the frozen food section. Okay, let's go down here. There's a lot of stuff to choose from. He's not wasting any time. He's going in for these again. 
I love how you just grab it and you say nothing. That's how serious you are. Serious stuff going on here, guys. I'm not worried about prices. I'm just looking at like how much you get. Trying to figure out the best value. So yeah, this is 240. This is just 200. So I'll get one of these. Sorry, VFC. So that this one's a better value for money. Yeah. What else you got your eye on? Veggie fingers. We've seen better prices than that, haven't we? Yeah. Price doesn't matter to you right now, Not does right it? Not right now. No. What have you spotted? There was a gasp for a game. You know those neon waffle fries? Yes. I'm guessing some of those. They're in the supermarket now, and now they're going to be in our trolley. Yeah. As you can guess for a game from their purchase, we're in the chips aisle. Oh, I love uh, crinkle pan chips, though. You're thrown by something in a different shape like that, are you? No, just like Different shaped potatoes, eh? <laughs> well, clearly, you've been won over by this shape. Yeah. Crinkle cut it is, eh? It's a big bag. Uh oh, he's hit dessert. What are you thinking? Um, um, am I going to agree with this? Vegan magnums. What ones? The almond ones. Those are my favourite vegan magnums. How many are in the box? Three. And how much are they for? Four pounds. Remember Heron Foods? Running out of space, Jojo. We're going to get one bag of frozen berries and then. Day. One bag of frozen berries, but six pot noodles. Is that right? Maybe two bags. Two bags of berries. So, I think I'm done shopping now. So Thank goodness. We can head to the checkout. <laughs> yes, and then when we get home, guys, we will share with you exactly how much Jojo spent. And if I personally think he's got enough food that can cover us for a week and it isn't just snack. So we'll see you back at home when we reveal to you those things. So we are back guys with all of this food and this very big receipt, Jojo. How was that? It was fun, I'd say. Yeah, yeah. I enjoyed myself. You seem to have a lot of fun. Now, before I go through this food and tell you whether or not I think all of this will feed us for a week, I'm gonna share with you how much you spent. Do you have an idea? I'm gonna say, there's quite a lot of food. I'm gonna say like 72 pounds. 72 pounds, that's quite an exact amount. It was actually 90 pounds oh and 38 pence. Goodness. At least I'm not the one paying for it. Woo! <laughs> so with that in mind of how much you spent, do you think you could do this same challenge again, but on a budget of 30 pounds like me and your mum do? Oh yeah, of course. Really? Yeah, I just had fun this time. That's, that was, that's like a third of how much you spent today. You reckon you could? Yeah, of course. Okay, well, we'll see about that then. Let us know, Free Game. Do you think Jojo should do it where he has to get our week shopping for 30 pounds? I might not let you choose the supermarket though. That's fine. Obviously, you'd put me in like a proper supermarket. Right? Yeah, we'll see. But yeah, we'd love to hear your feedback, Free Game. Let us know in the comments. So, looking at this, Jojo, I must admit, I know you spent 90 pounds, but you got a lot of good organic stuff, which obviously means you've been paying attention because you do recognize that from time to time, we do like getting a lot of organic, healthy stuff. I feel like you covered breakfast a lot. You got some granola, there's crumpets, there's bread. You got the milk to go with the granola and you got some different berries as well. So yeah, you, you seem to cover that, a lot of healthy stuff. Dinners and lunches, that's where it gets a bit unhealthier, I think, where you've got some of the chips and- No, but you've got green and stuff to go with. Yeah, and potatoes, yeah, and you've got some other veggies as well. And onions. Yeah, so I think you've done pretty well. I'd say maybe this probably would last us a week, although you probably could have done better not getting snacks. You got stuff which we didn't need, like the chocolate bars, although I'm very grateful. Get a little cheeky though, a little cheeky. But I'm sure your mum, when she comes home, will be grateful for the chocolate bars you got her. But yeah, you got a good variety, I'd say. The pot noodles, I don't know why you got those considering we know how much of a better price we can get them elsewhere. I'll tell you what, your mother won't be happy about that when she finds out. <laughs> and the magnums. I know we don't do stuff like this often. It seems like every Daddy, shopping challenge. Look, these cost four pounds. This is what you can do when you have no budget. Remember that. True, yeah, true. Maybe I'd be the same. Yeah, I haven't actually mentioned where Katie is today. Many of you are probably wondering. She's just out for the day, so this challenge was down to us. Imagine what she's going to think when she comes home and finds how much she spent on this challenge. Like I said, you've got a lot of fruit. You've got a lot of healthy stuff, which I'm happy about. I think it will cover us for a week. So I think all in all, Jojo, you did well. Oh. Although 90 pounds is a lot to spend. I'm really interested to see how you will do 30 pounds. Let us know, Free Game, do you think he can do that? 30 pound budget, considering what he did with no budget here. So I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. We'd love to hear your comments below on what you think if this happened in this video, whether or not you think it's gonna turn out well with Jojo doing a 30 pound budget shop. But that's where we're gonna say goodbye, guys. We'll see you all in the next video. Just remember though, no matter where you are in the world, you guys always stay free. And just keep rising.